Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KG48, and welcome back to Salt 2. Today, we are going to make the Wave Skipper, uh, but I'm not going to do it right away. We're going to go out and check out the rest of the town. Uh, we could do some buying and selling, which will be pretty fun. Uh, but before we do that, we have to decide what equipment we want to keep. Now, we do have this, like, um, quick menu here, and you can choose what to put in that quick menu by going to Equipment and then, you know, changing stuff up here. I am going to go with the Pirate's Cutlass. Does a little bit less damage, but it's got a much better block um, percentage, and it comes with two dexterity. So we're going to go ahead and put that right there, okay? And then we're going to make sure it's also in the number one spot. All right, uh, number one. There we go. And now we just do this, and we're good to go. All right, um, I, I just showed you how to switch things out with the equipment uh, area, because that is going to be really, really important for you. All right, so we got the cutlass. Um, oh, one other thing. The axe is not used for chopping down trees. I, I guess you can't chop down trees. I don't know. Um, but it, it's used for damage. Um, it has a little bit higher on the low end and a little bit lower on the high end. So I'm going to stick with the swords because I kind of like swords. So, All right, now that we've done that, I, I had to do that first because I want to know what to sell. So we got a merchant right here. All right, um, what do you have for sale? And we're going to go ahead and sell to him first. So we've got some bows. Now I should have one bow that is locked up and it's not. So we have to decide which kind of bow we want. Now I do have a bow down here. I think we're going to go with the adventurer's bow. Uh, let me take a look. All right, the regular bow is two to five. Hit chance scales with dexterity shoots arrows. This is the same thing, except it gives it dexterity and agility. So we definitely want the adventurer's bow. I think I'm going to put the adventurer's bow up here as well. So there we go. And now we come down here and now we go to sell stuff. The Adventures Bow will have this little thing up here telling me not to sell it, okay? So the Adventures Bow is definitely better, by the way. So we're going to go ahead and sell this one. Sell this one. I'm going to keep an eye on my copper because I'm not sure what the copper to silver ratio is. I'm thinking every 100 copper is one silver, but I really don't know. I'm going to sell the extra compass, compasses, compass eye. I don't know. I'm going to sell the cutlass. I'm going to sell this extra pirate's cutlass. And that's it for the weapons. I'm going to keep that. Uh, I'm not going to sell any food because you don't really get much for it anyway. Uh, and food's important. So, um, what is this? This is uh, crafting. All right, I'm, I'm not going to sell any of this stuff either. Uh, you don't sell, I don't really want to sell any anything else. Oh, no, this is a junk. Okay, so this junk stuff is simply junk. You just sell it. Can I sell all of these at once? Sell, hold, uh, hold after sell all. There we go. Sell, sell sell and sell all right now let's see if there's anything we'd like to buy off this guy we'll just bring all of his stuff up um arrows i could probably craft copper ore health potions i definitely want um let's just get oh he only had one okay so i guess it doesn't matter uh morning uh can be placed on ships mailbox for you should be concerning quests i don't have 20 silver so i guess it's irrelevant all right i'm not gonna spend all my money here because i want to go around and see uh who else has stuff for sale so we've got a hunter merchant Okay, and arrows, chili flakes, oh, cooking stuff, flint, ooh, a scholar's bow, what? oh, it's got a talent thing, inspect uh, talents, constitution, I think I'm going to stick with my bow, um, also, that's, like, that would, like, be most of my money, uh, ooh, a bow recipe, is that, is that good, now, what if I already know this recipe, will it tell me, I'm assuming it will, I don't know, I mean, I guess I can look, uh, thief's elixir, 15 minute, 5 dexterity, strong health potion that's way too expensive. Okay, I am not going to buy anything from these people. I just want to look, you know, look around and see what's for sale. Alright, like we got an herbalist. Good. Who are you? Uh, herbalist, blah blah blah, sounds interesting. Yeah, okay. Uh, more health potions. Stamina potions, morning dew. I think I need morning dew for stuff, but that's really expensive. And I don't really know what I would need hemp for. Can I steal any of this guy's stuff? Fantastic fungi and where to find them. Alright. There you go. Go ahead and pause the video if you want to read that. I might actually come back and pause the video and read it myself. I just don't like reading too much stuff on camera. It's, you know, do a let's play here and be reading all day. Alright. Let's try and see if we can take this stuff. I feel like I can if I could just get on the table. Alright. I don't know. Whatever. I don't care that much. <laughs> <laughs> Let's continue looking around. Alright, so this is going to be the chef. 
Alright, let's see what you have. Um, Captain's Cook Recipe. Uh, interact with this recipe to learn this recipe. A recipe for delicious cookies. Okay. Uh, we do need cooking oil, but I can make it. Uh, we will buy another health potion. And, alright. That'll be it for that. Can we cook anything in here? Uh, we are going to need cooking oil. Right? Um, health potions. Yeah, let's make some health potions. There we go. So we're going to need cooking oil. Now, in order to make cooking oil, we're going to need plant oil. In order to make plant oil, we make, oh, we can make, oh, we can make the dew. Interesting. And this is what you need the bottles for, by the way. So we're going to make some plant oil. And then we're going to make some cooking oil. I can't wait until these up, like, these level ups do something for me. And then we can cook stuff. We can cook uh, a couple bear meat. Um, we can cook some venison. All right, that's looking pretty good. And then, can we make some health potions? We're going to need some more morning dew. But we got to be careful because they both take the yellow flowers. All right, that's pretty good. Oh, look at that. It's daytime. Beautiful. All right, let's come in here. And you're an innkeeper. Like the browser. Oh, he sells... Yeah. That sells expensive, though. I won't buy it unless I have to. I actually read on uh, in the forums on Steam that the developers intend us to be nomads in this game uh there's going to be no building on islands um and you're supposed to keep moving but you can build on your ship your ship think of your ship is like a oh i didn't notice this think of your ship as like a floating island oh uh, okay uh, okay all right what do you got bro uh, okay there's a lot of stuff here a lot of stuff here we will be getting into at some point I'm just kind of giving you a, a, a tour, you know? Uh, I don't think a scout would have anything for me. Oh, by the way, this is the um, this is the smith. The blacksmith. Champion's axe recipe? Hmm. Uh, dead man's saber recipe? Oh, navigator's cutlass. Oh, look at that. I can afford that, too. Two to five, three to ten. Actually, none of that's really good except for the... um. The talent remaining. Uh, but I don't know if I can like see the the talents that you can pick. I think I'm gonna take I wanna I wanna get one recipe, so let's buy that. And the thing is I wish you could look at like the recipe to see if it's something you care about. Because it might not be something I care about, but let's learn it. Okay. So known recipes. And it's going to be a dead man's saber. So it's two to five, three to ten. 40% strength agility. Um, yeah, I mean, that's okay. It's not that great. I can make it, though, if I can get some leather. I probably can get some leather, too. But let's continue the tour. Uh, actually, that, I think that's the last guy that I'm aware of. All right, we're going to make the sword. I came to the weaving station, and right here is leather. I made the leather. I don't know if there's any reason to keep rawhide, but I'm only going to make leather I need to. Because, who knows, maybe we need rawhide for something. Now we need to come back here and find the blacksmith's place. Should be around here somewhere. There it is. Okay. I should have everything I need for this. If um, this works the way I think it is. Dead man's saber. Craft. Okay. And we're going to go to equipment. And we're going to go right here. And we're going to do dead man's saber. Oh, we need to do the talent thing for it. Um, okay. There we go. Dead man's saber. And then we're going to go to inventory. I'll, I'll stop doing this inventory management stuff. I'm just showing you guys how the game works, you know, in the beginning. So, all right. We need to do that. Um, all right. So, we could do plus one strength or plus one armor. Uh, higher AC, the greater chance to mitigate enemy damage. Um, it's already got one strength on it. So, I'm going to go with armor. All right. Now, that should have... Yep. One strength, one agility, one armor. Awesome. That's really cool. We'll sell that Pirate's Cutlass at some point. Actually, I could probably sell it right now, can't I? I don't know if different people sell, you know, give you more items for different stuff, but... Pirate's Cutlass. Same price. Okay. Very cool. So this is what the town has to offer. We got ourselves a new, a new sword, which is just awesome. And now we are going to go back to the cartographer. And we are going to go ahead and make the boat. I kind of wanted the sun to be up when I made the boat, too, so... Let's come in here and make it. Alright. Oh, there's a third one. Wait. Oh, it's not a boat. 
salt stained stool can be placed on ships. Oh, so I'm wondering if this is where you have to come to place stuff on ships. Okay. All right. Well, whatever. We're going to make the shit. Oh, did I spend what I needed for this thing? Oh, crap. He gave me what I needed. I might have spent it on that. Damn it. Now I have to kind of... Okay, I can get the copper back. I don't know about the wood. Ah! I shouldn't have made the sword. All right, we're going to need some copper ingots. I'm here with the blacksmith, and he's got a forge right next to him. Okay. And we're going to go ahead. I don't see any reason not to turn this all into ingots. So that's what I'm going to do. All right. I did find the work, the wood workstation. I'm going to show you where it is in case you uh, had this problem in your game. And the wood workstation is right over here right outside the um one of these buildings yeah this one right here the uh, archery building the um the hunter merchant the wood stations right here and that's what i did i went ahead and made some planks you can also make fishing poles lures and stuff like that i guess i might as well make a fishing lure There's no reason not to all right what is this guy he's just a regular general merchant okay good all right let's go make our thing um yeah we just passed it let's go make our our boat i can't believe i did that Wave skipper. There you go. All right, speak with the cartographer. Now that you've created yourself a real ship, it's time to put some crafting stations on it. Lucky for you, I sell the crafting stations you'll need. Okay, so it looks like we don't craft them. You'll need to buy the forge, weaving station, woodworking station, cooking station, cartographer station. That ought to get you started. All right, let me see your inventory. Um, uh, uh, Cartography ship recipe. Oh, they're really cheap. Okay, good. I was hoping they'd be cheap. All right, so let's see. We're looking for stuff that says station. So let's see. Six cent. Basic workbench, right? That's got to be something we need. Sounds about right. Cartographer ship recipe. It's too much. Um, cartographer station. Cooking station. Forge. Uh, mystery map box. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Well, we, that's not what we're looking for, though. Um, weaving station. Woodworking station. Whoa, what is this? Red Raider recipe. Learn, Interact to learn this recipe. Oh, wow. For an uncommon ship. I mean, I can't afford it, but... Um, I'd like to get the mailbox. Can't afford it. Can't afford it. Oh, wow. Look at this stuff. Okay. Right. I think that's about everything I need to get. Oh, it actually tells you which ones to buy. Okay, make sure you're going to buy them all. You got all the crafting station, everything you need. When you get your ship, put those crafting stations somewhere on the deck. You will get a craft while sailing. A novel idea. No? You can also track any recipe you find. Oh, and don't forget to use a cartographer station to craft ship decorations and customize your vessel. Here, take this recipe for a bed to get you started. It's on the house. Good luck to you. Thank you. All right, I think we're done with this. Uh, I think we're done with this town now. I think we can now uh, get on out there and do our thing. All right, let's uh, put down the ship. Nope. Oh, careful. One hit point. All right, so we're looking at inventory and ships. And there's the wave skipper. Um, a beautiful ship with an intricate design. Fit for any reasonable, a respectable sailor. You can redeploy for... Yeah, I got that. Okay, please. Cool. Oh, we got a real ship. This is great. Oh, look at this. Look at this thing. Hell of an upgrade from what we had before, huh? Oh, freaking cool. Now, I'm trying to debate on where I want to put these crafting stations. I kind of want to put them in here, but I also want to sleep in here. So, um, I guess I'm just going to start placing them and we'll see what we can do. All right. So, rotate is... Place. Yes. Okay. I see. I guess there's no way to... Oh, yeah. Le le uh, right mouse button rotates the other way. All right. Cool. So, we'll just put that right up. I'm going to try and place it with the freaking mouse button. I'm not used to mouse buttons being rotate. That's like very, very new to me. Uh, hold F to place. There we go. And it wants me to make a bed, I believe. Or it said make a bed. I don't know where the quests went. Um, hold on a sec. Quests. Uh, nope, that's it. Okay. So, I don't know. I got to make the bed. I'm not really sure what to, what to use to make the bed. I think for now, I'm just going to place everything down. Cooking station can go outside. Um, but I'd like it to be underneath something, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. Uh, <laughs> uh, maybe I'll put it by the door at least. Yeah, that'll work. Actually, let's put a different let's put a different thing down 
first in the corner. Um, cartographer station. All right, sounds good. All right, so we'll put that right here. Let me go put the cooking station right in front of it. The ship is really good, but I'm kind of looking forward to getting a better one, a bigger one. This this one, I feel locked in. All right, and we're gonna put this right here. All right, there you go. I just don't want to put anything outside. It's like you know, uh, well the forge should probably yeah we could place this outside. This is protected from the rain. Uh, where do I want to put it though? Put it up here, down here. I used to putting stuff on pirate ships. So this is all new to me. I guess I'll just put the forge right here. Seems like a pretty good spot for it. Is that the front? No, that's the back. All right, or the stern or the bow or the hell it's called. All right, and there we go. And then the weaving station. This could also probably be outside. But I'm going to try and put it in here first. We'll see. If I run out of room in here, I'll start putting stuff outside. The game doesn't have anything against you putting stuff outside. It's just for me personally. You know? That's just kind of how I look at it. Like, I don't want to, like, leave stuff outside. Because then it's, like, uh, susceptible to the to the elements, like the rain and stuff. Um, yeah, sure. It's pretty decent. There's not a lot of room in here, so. And we've got a chest. Alright. Uh, should probably go like that. Beautiful. Alright, so now we need to make a bed. It's a woodworking station? I don't remember where the bed is. Alright, so I actually got the um, recipe for the bed. That's what I got, so. I'm gonna go ahead and read that. Alright, now, as I'm doing stuff here, I'd like to maybe start sailing towards another island. Do I just, like, randomly sail out? Or should I save up for maybe one of those map packs? Or uh, the, the guy out there at a map pack? I don't know. I think I'm going to sail out randomly. And just kind of see what's out there. Uh, I'm not really sure. Uh, I'm thinking this thing goes a lot faster than the other ship, too. Alright, so, uh, known recipes. We got the bed. Uh, decorations. There we go. Uh, basic woodworking. Okay. We're going to need some, uh, some sand stain. What the hell is that? Like a woodworking station. Okay. So, let's see if we have what we need for it. No. So, let's see what it is. It's called Can you, like, can you, like, um, like, search? Is there, like, a search option? Like, I can just put in sand something and just look for it? Because I'm not really sure what that is. And like some of these are really oh there we go. No, that's light resin. Uh there it is, sand stain. Okay, so we're gonna need some morning dew. I think the morning dew was made in this, right? Morning dew? There it is. Alright. So let's make some morning dew. And uh, yeah, again, like, you have to really search through this, I think. Maybe I'm missing it. Maybe there's a search option. I just don't see it. Very well could be the case. All right. So, for the bed. Known recipes. Decoration. Um, okay, we just need a couple wood planks. Uh, stuff I have the recipes for. Make a few of these. And then we should be able to make the bed. Um... Hmm, I should have everything I need for it. Is, is it made in the word woodworking station? Cartographer station, duh. That's right, he did say that, um... Wait, do I have two wood... Oh, that's a workbench woodworking bed. Okay, he did say it would be in the cartographer station. And there we go. And we go to our inventory. And I don't know where that would be. Consumable, worn, recipes, crafting, key quest, maps. There it is. Please. And I guess I'll just put this right here for now. It's not the perfect setup, but it'll do for the time being. Alright, cool. Is there anything out there? I'm not seeing any islands or anything. Um, uh, let's take our cartographer thing and see where you are. I'd like to make some lights, too. I wonder if there's lights. Alright, the cartographer thing. Hold E. Cartographer thing. Do that. That'll show us where we're on the map. Okay, so we're heading north. Alright. Again, I don't know, like, if I'm supposed to be going in a certain spot or just kind of sailing out randomly. That looks like there might be an island over there. 
Is that an island? It kind of looks like it. All right, I am at a random island. Just slept through the night and then ate breakfast. And this is where we are. Okay, so let's go check it out. Let's see what's what. I'm guessing there's going to be pirates on a lot of these islands. So we'll have to see. I'm going to have to grab everything I can. Um, if I see any animals, I'm going to kill them. Because I, I had to eat a good amount of food this morning. Um, I think my food does 17. Let me see. Yeah, 17 food. Okay. So that means I need to eat at what? Um, 83? Sounds right to me. Um, oh, crap. I forgot arrows. All right, I'm not going to worry about it. We'll make some when we get back. Uh, come on, kill him. Kill him. He'll stop running or turn around or something soon. That's what they do. Oh, what the hell was that? It was a boar. He seemed like he was attacking me. All right. Trying to lead me to danger? I don't think so. Oh, God, he left, he left me to, he led me to danger. He led me to danger. Alright, there you go, and you're done. I'm not the best fighter, <laughs> but... Alright, number four. Let's make sure we got the meat off that guy. Um, Yeah, we did. Okay, good. I looted him kind of quick. Alright, let's look around since we're here. Oh, another skeleton. Right. They have a large um, attack radius. I can't get the block down. I don't like. I'm not sure if it's because I'm failing the block or what. But yeah, the block the block is not working for me too well. So I kind of find like maybe jumping out of the way to be a little bit more efficient. So I don't know. I'll get better at it, or or I won't. Okay. Oh, a pirate's cutlass. That'll sell. All right, what do we got over here? Craft. Okay, just a workbench. Right, just watching out for more skellies. Come on, skeletons. Where are you? Is that it? It's cool that there's skeletons. <laughs> I like that. Oh, God. Ah, uh, see? Yeah, they hear from... All right, let's try it. All right, so did I do it or... I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I blocked or if I didn't, or I'll watch the video back. It's a little bit, you know, it, it's a little bit much to like notice everything when you're actually doing it. When I watch the video back, though, it'll be a lot, a lot better, a lot easier to tell what's going on. A skeleton there. You missed, sucker! I love this. I love the archers. They seem to be a little bit easier to deal with. Oh, here we go. Um, you know what? I'll mine that later. Let's continue to look around. Let's see if there's anything. Oh, there's something. Oh, I can go inside. All right. I see. All right. So, it doesn't look like there's too much more around here. I think it's time to go inside. Oh, there we go. Love it. I don't know what that rope's for, but it's got to be something useful. Mm -hmm. Oh, butter. Beautiful. Love me some butter. Okay, I think I looked... No, no I didn't look in there. Alright, I think we're I think it's time to go inside. Every time I think it's time to go inside, there's more to loot. Ancient key recipe? Arrows? Oh, beautiful. Alright, now it's time to go inside. And we will save. Because we just got a bunch of dope loot. Alright, let's try it. Oh. Oh, this is a lot different than the other place I went in. Grab those. Huh. Uh, I was going to say, this is a trap. I've ever seen one. 
Damn it. Okay. I'm definitely blocking because I'm taking less damage when I block. That's for sure. Like that one block, I only took one damage. Alright. So we got one over there. How many arrows do I have left? I wish I would tell you. Um, can't even do that. You have to go into uh, equipment. Yeah, four arrows left. Not good. Oh, shit. Nah, fuck all that. <laughs> he was blue and he had a buddy. I don't mind fighting the blue guy, but not when he has a buddy. Alright, let's try again. I don't know if they all respawn or not. Uh, it doesn't seem like it. I don't see anything. Where the hell are they? Hello? Hmm. What the hell? I don't like this. Oh, there he is. Okay, he's just a regular guy. Okay. Alright. Heal up. Save up. And hopefully it's just the boss guy now. Although I don't know where he is. It doesn't look like he's over here. I'm guessing he's gotta be in there. I guess I could just steal his loot and get the hell out of here. Alright. Health potions, human bones. Ooh, scuffed diamond. And pirate's cutlass. Some of that. Some of that. Got some oil. That. Alright. Save the game. Try and fight the blue guy. He's around here somewhere. I don't know where the hell he went. He's gotta be in here, right? There he is. That's not the blue guy. I don't know why I thought it was him. You saw the guy's name was Blue, right? Oh, I parried. Oh, that was good. Okay, that worked out well. And I leveled up. I don't know if leveling up does anything. I know the I know the stats or the um, skills don't do anything, but I don't know if leveling up actually does something. Let's take a look at our stats. No, see, health is still thirty nine. So I'm not sure what leveling up does or how you get more health. I really want to know where that blue guy went. He, I did see a guy with his name being and his name was Blue, wasn't it? I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to watch it back. Maybe it wasn't. Maybe I was just imagining things. I swear it was. Uh what's my hunger at 79? Inventory eat. Alright. Yeah. Where is this freaking guy? Where is this freaking guy, huh? Is that him? Yep, that's him. Alright, let's do this. Let's dance. Where's he going? He's going over this way. Okay. Alright, buddy. Stick and move. Okay. Looks like I'm getting out of range of his attacks. Beautiful. Got him. Wasn't even that hard. All right. Ancient moss. Explorer's bow recipe. Lockpick. Scholar's drink. Skulls. What's that scholar's drink? Uh, 10 health. 5 constitute. Wow. Cool. That okay. Alright, um... Okay, so it's Constitution and Health Potion. Okay. Fair enough. Alright, let's look around in here. I'll probably do some mining. There we go. I'll turn that off. I didn't realize my timer was going off. Freaking crazy episode, huh? I wonder if that's one of the guys who has a chance to drop that one quest item I have. I'm gonna need a mailbox, because I think in order to turn in quests, 
I want a mailbox, so I'd have to go all the way back. Pirate's Courage. Seven Wow, Jesus. Some of this stuff is sick. Alright, let's look over here. More chests. Uh, pickaxe. Another chest. More pickaxes. Oh, scuffed ruby. Yeah, we're making bank today, people. Hell yeah, we are. So I was just out here hunting some boars, just, you know, didn't think of anything of it. And then there's a freaking named boar out here. A purple name. I got no more arrows, so I gotta try and run them down. These guys are tough. I killed a regular boar earlier, and I was like, I'll just, you know, I'll just get some boars and, you know, call it a day. But man, I come across a named boar. Come on. Yeah, got him. Gold Fangs Iris? What the fudge? Dude, this game is freaking dope, man. Super, super deep. I'm really excited to see what else it has to offer. I am going to have to call this one here, though. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.